What is up, warriors? It's the Quad Father here. And now, starting right now, you and I, together, we're going to go on a journey. And the journey has to do with goals. The, the journey has to do with setting goals for yourself that you can accomplish and that you can check back here in the comment section below, okay, to register how well you've been doing at your goals or areas that you need to learn to do better in your goals. And that's where this series is going to be all about the different pitfalls, making goals, creating new goals, seeing how well you're doing on your goals, how well you're progressing. And I'm going to be doing it with you right here. So I know as I record this, it's the beginning or almost the beginning of 2014. And people are making a lot of New Year's resolutions. And I've never been big into New Year's resolutions because I've always thought, Resolutions can be made at any time. I mean, why do they have to be done at New Year's? No, it can be done. Matter of fact, I've been doing resolutions for a long time. Matter of fact, I'm doing one right now with my son. We, what we do is we pick one thing to do a month or to not do in a month. Like, for instance, last month, we just didn't eat bread. <laughs> he said, it was kind of hard at school because I got known as the kid with the bag of meat, you know, because he'd take his ham or whatever and in a bag and no have no bread. But now why do we do it? Are we gluten free? No, none of that stuff. It was really more of just a challenge. And this month in December, um, what we chose to do was after breakfast, the only thing we were going to drink all day was water. You know, we gave ourselves a few days off. And that's one of the things that I can do is I'll give you guys tips on how we go about setting goals and what it does for us. I mean, think about it. Every time I have the opportunity to drink something else throughout the day after they think, oh no, I'm just drinking water, which I know is a healthy thing. I mean, all the goals that I'm gonna talk about and hopefully all the goals that you guys are gonna make are gonna be healthy and, and good for you to make you feel better about yourself as well as to make you a better person. So um, those are those are a couple of the things that, that I've done so far. And you know, like I've done like do 10 pushups every day for a month. Okay, you know what, it, it requires discipline. It requires just remembering to do it. I mean, do I put a reminder on my calendar so it, it triggers me every day? What, what do I do? You know, the different tips and techniques that I can give you and that we can do to work together. Maybe you guys can share what's working for you guys. Um, but the, one of the things is that I'm going to be talking about, and I'm going to talk a little bit about tonight, is sometimes is goals. Sometimes people say, "Well, I want to be a doctor." Well, that's that's great, but you're in. 12th grade right now, uh, doctor's long journey. So what do you have to do in order to make those steps possible? What do you have to do today? What do you have to do in the next hour? What do you have to do in the next day, next week, next month, and so on, as you guys can see. So we could share together, you know, through this journey. I will share my progress with you. Um, next month, I'm going to exercise every day. Okay, so why do you care, right? Well, what we're going to talk about is some of the things that that I have to do that things, pressures that, that I run into, um, obstacles, distractions, you know, pressure from the family, you know, different things, you know, people think you're weird, you know? So, um, people, people will have a lot of ways to try to get you down to keep you from reaching your goal. And it's not mean. They're not rotten people. I don't just have bad people in my life. No, people somehow get intimidated when someone's achieving a goal. Um, especially if it's a goal that they think they should do themselves. They want to tell you all the reasons that you shouldn't do it yourself. So over the next year, actually, is, is one of my goals, is to be able to give you guys updates on how I'm doing on my goals. So I will share annual goals with you. I will share monthly goals with you. Um, talk about how's it, how it's going, and I hope you'll do the same. I hope you'll talk in the comment section below um, about you know the, whatever how whatever you're doing in your goals or your progress um, because I want you to come and check back here because one of the things I think that's really important for reaching your goals is talking to somebody else about it having somebody else involved a lot of people start the gym together right New Year's coming up people want to lose weight they resolve to lose 10 20 pounds okay well that, that's good those are good goals you got to have a destination right if you don't know where you're going how you how you gonna know the path to take you there? Um, but there's always pitfalls, right? To to losing weight, you know. It, but one of the things people do when they start to lose weight is they say, "I'm gonna join the gym." Fantastic. Gyms are full of people who aren't there, or members who aren't there, um, and not full of people who uh, should be going. But everybody has good intentions, so they sign up for a year. So people oftentimes will try to get someone else to go along with you. Sometimes that's hard because if they start to fail, then you give yourself an excuse not to go or whatever. could be any goal. Um, and this can be a place where you and I can go back and forth on what's going on with your goals and 
you, you can get a partner here because anybody who's who's here and talking about whatever their goals are is going to be committed or at least available. Somebody's going to be available to um, you know chat with you. To I mean, it's, I'm not I'm not creating a support service here. I'm saying we all can be in this together. And if if you post and someone responds, they you run into a problem. Someone responds. The idea is that we are all going to be making goals, and I'm going to be sharing my journey with you. And hopefully, what I go through will help you to reach the goals that you want to achieve in a small way and in the long term. So until then, I will get back to you real soon and you can follow this journey at any point in time. You just start right here and keep watching the videos and I will see you when I reach my next goal.